to another video. Today we've got a fun one, but a slightly different one. We're going to be going out in London to Canary Wharf and to Chinatown to try and get some sci-fi kind of futuristic looking shots. We're going to go out, I've got a few places in mind, and then I'm going to come back here, edit them, and I'll show you what I get. So, let's get straight to it. I might be on the wrong side of the platform. Alright, we're at the first location, which is West India Key. We get our first 80 style shot, which is going to be a long exposure with the DLR and the road. Let's see what we can do. I did go on the wrong side of the platform initially, but I've made it where I think I need to be. I'm going to set up the tripod here. And I think I'm going to get a pretty cool shot here. Which could look a bit sci-fi 80s. That's loud. Alright. Nice and quiet here. Yeah. Yeah, it's got a bit of a nice sci-fi cyberpunk. Like a futuristic city vibe. Uh, I don't know how tall I want to go with the tripod. I think I'm going to do this and see what happens. Wait, not that. Let's calm down here. I hate stepping up tripods. Right. Well, that probably makes me look really small because the tripod's higher up. <laughs> right, I want to go. Uh, what am I doing? I'll go five seconds first. Can I go closer? Alright, we'll do a little, a little teaser shot. Right. Let's see what we get. Okay, let's fill out the composition a bit here. Need a train spin to me. Right, I'll we'll get some more of the long exposure of the road, and then maybe we'll blend these together and make a composite to get more light trails in there which we can just do on Photoshop. But I want to get, I want to get one a bit closer as well. Like here. So really get the light trails and the road in there, make sure we've got it. Also looks kind of cool with the track in the foreground, the car in the background, and then the skyline. Oh, these are looking good. I do know, I don't know if you can see these. If I tilt back and look like a weirdo that you'll be able to see. I don't know if I've got severe back problems, but you can't tell. Oh, that's good. I like that one. Go a bit closer. Nice. Oh, we've got a train coming. Shit. Right. Oh, fuck, fuck. What have I done? This is the longest six seconds of my life. Okay. Let's see this. I think I need to go out a bit further if I want to get the train in and the skyline. Let's go to there. Oh, it's the moment we've all been waiting for. Also, on a side note, DLR is the best line. If you didn't know, you can go to the front and you can sit at the front and feel like you're driving the train, which is really cool. All right, here we go. Oh my God, it looks, I think it looked good. Jesus Christ, this platform is shaking like mad. I think we got that. 
shot of Alex and Rio. Apart from that one weird reflection. Right, let's get another one. unreal as well. Alright, we're good. Let's go to the next location. Right, we're in the second spot. But I don't know if this is going to work. I'm planning on flying a drone here, but I've got a feeling I'm not going to be allowed to fly it here. I think DJI will know that you're not allowed to fly it here, it won't let me take off, but we're going to give it a try anyway. And on the bright side, I've got a beer, so life's good. Yeah, good work. Alright, let's see what happens. It says authorization zone. That's already not encouraging. I'd really love to get this done quickly and get out of here with no problems. Why is it not connecting to the drone? Oh, Jesus Christ. What's going on? Oh. Authorization zone. Hmm. Oh, nice, I unlocked it. Compass calibration required. Oh, for the love of God. Go, be free. Am I facing the wrong way? For God's sakes. Oh, wow, that looks insane. Okay, so we've made it back and didn't get to go to Chinatown. Well, I did go to Chinatown, I just didn't get to record it because well, I ran out of battery. But um, basically it was full of drunk people and I got a few photos. And then missed the last train back, so I had to get two buses, so that was nice. Anyhow, we're going to have a look at the photos and I'll show you what I got. So, the first one was at uh, Canary Wharf, was well, near Canary Wharf, it was at East India train station. And this is the photo that I got in the end. Um, it's hard to get the colours kind of right for this, so I tried it a couple of different ways. This was the first one where I went with red for the train. Uh, it's got a pretty cool futuristic vibe. I was really happy with the, um, the blur from the uh, train tube, the DLR, whatever you want to call it. But um, a pretty cool photo, I think. I'm quite happy with it. Uh, to show you the other way I did it, um, this one. I tried putting some pinks into it to try and get like that pink kind of teal look which is you know a bit more cyberpunk maybe but um, personally I don't really like it. It was weird editing these because they aren't really things I generally put on my feed so it was fun challenge to be able to edit in a different way but it was 
kind of strange because every time I did it, I was like, I don't know how I feel about this. But um, I think those are quite cool. This is one other way I got it as well, um, where I, a bit more blurred. I think I prefer this one the most out of all of them, actually. Uh, the blur looks better. It's kind of more faded. Uh, the colors work better. It's a bit more futuristic, I think. So, yeah, happy with that one. Um, on to the next one. This was the train coming the op from the opposite uh, platform. Um, I really like this. I think it's really cool. The only thing I don't like is this little blur here, which is just quite distracting and annoying, so I'd have to crop it and get rid of that, realistically. But still, really cool shot. It definitely feels futuristic, and I'm happy with that. Um, this is without any trains, um, and it's got the long exposure from the cars. Um, I'm really happy with this again. This, this is really cool, I think. It definitely got a nice sci-fi feel. Um, the teal and oranges work very well for it. It's a little bit kind of Blade Runnery. Uh, but yeah, really cool spot. If you do live in London, East India Quay, check it out. This is a closer one where you can see the long exposure from the car very well. Um, I like that the rest of the image is darker and it kind of focuses on that middle part. Um, really cool, happy with that again. Then this is the first of the drone shots, which um, is all right. Um, I had a bit of issues with the long exposure. Um, I was shooting about three seconds on the drone, but it was quite windy and it didn't really stabilize very well. So some of the shots weren't ideal. This one's a little bit better. Um, I tried editing this in a few different ways as well, as you'll see later. But um, this one's pretty cool. Uh, this is one of Canary Wharf. I feel, this has got, to me this feels like Blade Runner. It's got like LA vibes in the future. I think it's really cool. I'm happy with this one. This is another way I tried editing the other one. I put a fake sky in. <laughs> I'm not too happy with it. It's a difficult one to edit and get right, but um, it's pretty good. It's all right. I just would wish that the long exposure had stabilized and that the camera could have been a bit more sharper. But win some, you lose some. This one I like a lot. I really like the colors in this, kind of like the neon blue and the magentas there with the oranges. Um, I think it's really good. Happy with that one. That's one of my favourite ones, maybe. Again, I just wish there was a bit sharper. This one is my favourite one. The colours are sick. It looks really cool. It looks like some kind of mad sci-fi highway that you get in a film, where it's like fucking hover cars shooting along or something, I don't know, whatever they have in the future. But yeah, this is my favourite photo. I think it's really cool. Let me know what you think, but yeah, I'm happy with this one. Um, this is another one I changed the colours for. And then we have the Chinatown ones. Um, it's pretty. Chinatown. <laughs> Every movie must think that China is going to take over the world, which they might do. <laughs> but there's always like a Chinatown in any kind of sci fi cyberpunk movie. So it was the obvious place to go to and try and get some photos. Um, I'm happy with the colors in this one. It's pretty cool. I like this one a lot. It's kind of got a dreamy feel to it. Um, the lanterns look really good above. And I like that the street's pretty much empty apart from three people. Um, maybe not too sci-fi, but a little bit futuristic, I guess. But either way, it's a cool shot, so. This one, this guy was just chilling there, so I thought I'd take a photo of him. Um, pretty cool. And yeah, that's all of them. So, please do let me know what you think. Um, do you think I should try this again? Uh, which one was your favourite photo? Please let me know in the comments. And if there are any other videos like this, then let me know what you think I should do next. But yeah. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.